Are universities worth the money? This question has become an increasing influence to undergraduate students deciding whether or not to go to university from this school and from across the country. In this documentary we aim to find out whether university is worth the money by asking those who have been to university and those who have not to understand the most current situations. The stars creak, I shall sleep, it's keeping me awake. It's the house telling you to close your eyes. In order to obtain a range of opinions on the cost of university, we interview a variety of people. This first interview is with Charlotte Leslie, an ex-student who went into employment in the media industry rather than going to university. What are your views on the current university fees? Um, I think the fees are a little drastic. I think they've risen too much. I think the fees, how they were when um, I was going to university, which I think was around the three grand mark, was fine. It was something people, you know, it was, it was not great because obviously it's three grand, but it's affordable. It's something that we can get loans out. Whereas now it's gone up to like six grand, you know, seven grand, and it's just ridiculous because people can't afford it now. Did university fees hinder your decision to go? Um, yes. It, it, to, to an extent it did, um, not so much I think for my year because we were still on the original fees but I, I know definitely for a lot of people, um, including myself, the fees were kind of do I want to get a loan, do I want to get into debt, you know, is it worth it, you know, you know, I think you really have to kind of think at the end of the day, what do I want to be? Without a university degree, do you think it's harder to get a good standard of job? Um, I think it's I think it's quite difficult to sort of answer that question because it all depends on what you want to do. I think if you want to aim high and you want to go for a, a, a specific career, then you know I think definitely a degree is what you need. When we were young, oh, oh we did enough. When it got cold. To find out if the cost of university has been a long-standing influence to students' decision, we interviewed Rory Whelan, a postgraduate who's just completed his three-year course in nutrition and hygiene. Did the cost of university influence your decision to go? Yeah, I, mean, I suppose it probably did actually. Obviously it was only £3,000 back then when I, when I started university four years ago. So yeah, I mean, had it been £9,000 when I went, not sure whether I would have gone, maybe not. I mean, I'm not, sh not too sure really. It's a lot of money. In your experience, do you think a degree is worth the cost of university? In my experience, yeah, it probably is actually. Uh, like I said earlier, I only spent £3,000 on my degree, which was Nutrition and Hygiene at Bolton Uni. And um, yeah, I think, it, I think it was okay for me because I've managed to get myself an apprenticeship uh, at the Boots headquarters, which is in London. And uh, it's going quite well at the moment, so hopefully they'll be able to incorporate me into their company and I'll be able to get a full time job with them. Um, but yeah, a couple of friends of mine, uh, Timmy Wallin and Mah Mohammed, they haven't actually been able to find a job and they're still living at home. Um, they're still unemployed, so I've seen both sides of the story really and how it can work out and how it can't work out. What are the costs you have to consider when going to university? Um, probably there's two other, other main costs from the ones that you mentioned earlier. So you've got your accommodation and your food. Um, with accommodation it's quite simple really, There's you pay a monthly fee but that's already set before you go there so you can plan for that, it's quite easy to know what you're going to spend. Uh, food sort of depends on the circumstances that you're in. So in our halls there was this strange Namibian guy called Terence Carter Davidson and uh, he was quite strange, he ate all these weird meats like pheasant and duck and uh, he, filled up our, he filled up our fridge with quite a lot of this stuff so that was quite expensive obviously but I mean in weird circumstances like Terence's, um, there's going to be differences, but yeah, it depends on, on your circumstances. Understanding the opinion of somebody who is considering whether or not to go to university will provide us with a vital insight into what influences their decision. I've come to Woking College Library to speak to Jamie Ross, an undergraduate student who is unsure whether or not university is worth his time or money. What are your main worries about going to university? Uh, I think my main worries are mainly the accommodation, the fees for the accommodation, uh, that combined with, you know, is my heart really in it to go to university for three years and study journalism, and I think also the uncertainty of going into employment after university. Do you think the cost of university is unfairly influencing your choice to go? 
Uh, yeah, I think so, uh, to an extent. I think if the university fees were lower, like they were five, six years ago, then maybe I'll be considering it a bit more now. Do you think a university degree is worth the money? Uh, yeah, to an extent. I think if you want to go to university to do a doctor's degree, then it's essential to, to go. But in my case, going to do journalism, I think there are other opportunities, like getting a job at a local newspaper, which is something I personally would like to do. In this next part of the documentary, we will look at factors that influence the decision, such as debt, choice of course, and unemployment.